And to other stories, minimum energy performance standards for lighting products helps mitigate the effect of climate change while promoting energy efficient and sustainable light solution. That's according to the director of standards organization, Farouk Salim, during a workshop in Lagos, which also seeks to consider energy labeling component for lighting appliances. This comes just as stakeholders in the lighting sector believe efficient electricity use is one of the fastest ways to accelerate sustainable development and achieve a net zero energy target by 2060. This uh, document that is you know, going to come out, out of this workshop and then that will be approved as standard letter is going to tell us how efficient a particular bulb is and how you know, cost you know, uh, and I, how expensive it is to be used in the house, or less expensive to be used in the houses. By eliminating these products from the market, consumers will no longer have uh, be presented with inefficient, low-quality, environmentally damaging products. And also, by eliminating those products from the market, will de decrease the demand on the grid. You have infiltration of fake product or substandard product into the country. We are not helping ourselves. So the first thing to do, the first leg of the whole process of banning mercury containing product is to have put a standard in place. And that's what this minimum energy performance standard is talking about.